Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to episode 14 of Let's Play Cube World and look at that I'm level 17. Didn't think I'd get that far but uh, I did get that far. Um, 17 and a half actually. Um, it seems like you know the, the higher you get the easier things become to kill well depending where you are but uh, you start getting a little more EXP over time which is nice. And, well, that's sort of what's been happening, so that's been a, a nice treat anyways. Um, so, I'm using... Let's see. Overall, I don't think I got any new items as much as I got... Uh, I was able to equip that new staff, which was the 43, plus 43. Um, which was, you know, 19.5 damage, so that's a, a nice bonus of damage. You can see I have a lot of things in my inventory now. 99% of it was outdated cloth item and a lot of it is friggin rogue and ranger like hardcore um and the last two items i got i the boss did respawn like i said uh was this extraordinary chest and extraordinary chest again i don't know how uh and if you recall when we did it it was the shoulders but all for ranger so that was a bit of a a punch to the balls but in a sense it was a ranger boss and I don't know if that actually has an effect on what drops from it but you know what benefit of the doubt there uh, it was definitely not you know one of our kind of bosses uh, not a mage type boss anyways so we're gonna head to these other catacombs this way um, and see if we can get something different there I haven't touched any of my points yet I guess I've been saving them now I might as well put them into uh, Climbing and then gliding, really. So let's do that now. So climbing now takes 37.5 less stamina during climb. That's that's a nice handy thing. And now we can do enable uh, hang gliders. So that was my first point into it. And it's 177% speed. Next one's 200. So And so forth, of course, as we level. Um, we're not near a town right now. We won't be probably near a town for a couple episodes at least, but... Uh, Definitely next time we go to a town, we will be buying ourselves our first uh, hang glider, so that'll be a nice little treat. Let's see how it's going here. Okay. Just that way. And this catacomb is not blue anymore, it's white, so uh, it should be a little easier too. Not that we would have had a problem anyways, I'm Missy Obed A.S. Kane. But, uh, yeah, I've had a lot of fun doing that. I mean, I did it, I guess, two more times, I guess. I, well, I defeated the boss twice, so. I think I may have done almost three runs, because uh, the boss wasn't there. I think the boss takes a little longer to uh, spawn. So what I did was I went and did other, th other things, and I just had the game minimized, basically, AFK uh, outside the uh, catacombs. And uh, then I just went back, basically, and uh, sort of what I did. I don't know if this is a fake tunnel. Ah, oh, there's nothing there! Let's see how close we're getting there. Oh, we're getting there. Yeah, but I'm actually having a lot more fun now that I'm understanding the game a bit better and dodging. Oh my. As much as other people will say it a lot, I'm gonna have to say it. Dodging is important, guys. <laughs> dodging is very important. You gotta make sure you keep dodging or you're gonna screw up. Uh, that dodging helps a lot, and I'm not good at it at all, but, you know, I'm practicing, I'm working on it. But all I can say is dodging is definitely important. And here we go. And, uh, yeah, white guys here. Hopefully they're not super white or anything. Let's see what they get for EXP. So 5 EXP, 4 EXP, so about the same level. Um, I guess there isn't a way to scroll and chat, is there? No, I don't think so. So maybe a little more EXP? I'm not quite sure. But either either way, EXP is either uh, EXP, and it's not too, too bad, so that's good. And uh, oh, look at this. There's a formula sitting on that desk. Cute. Let's see what we got over here. Oh, this wasn't very exciting. Yeah, I guess the other one was about five or six, so this may be less, or maybe about the same, I'm not sure. 
We're the skeleton. I hate skeletons so much. Out of everything, send me anything but a skeleton. Stupid super amount of health. I guess in a way they're like werewolves, but still. Still annoying in the AS. Oh, don't heal. I'm trying to kill you here. Yeah, see the tempo? It's 183 and then back to 121. That's from me keeping on hitting it over and over and over, which is very interesting. Do this. There we go. Whatever happened to my damn pet? Oh well. <laughs> Go, 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 go! Come on, Kane. I need you not to overly fail this. There we go. One more time. There we go. Woo! Nice. Looks like this one's a dead end. Now, have I got any blues yet? I don't know. I wonder if I'm getting less good quality items in that other dungeon I had. I guess maybe that also has a factor here and there. Maybe that was like a plus two or something before and now it's not. Though I wonder if it shows plus two even if they're white or not. That's a good question. Some some dungeons are harder than others. And they'll say like plus one, plus two. We saw mobs, didn't they, before that were like plus two and we're like, whoa. They hurt a lot. Ah, you tricky bastard. There we go. Yeah, the loot isn't as abundant as that other one, I don't Well, maybe. But it's been pretty white, so yeah. That's interesting. I wouldn't bother farming the other one because the item levels on it's not getting that good, but I you know, farmed enough for what I needed, but uh, definitely interesting. Got to keep that in mind. Still good for EXP though, I can't deny that. So colorful, damn mages. Ooh, they're getting too fast on me. You remember, they have the same bonus, right? So. There we go. Knocked them over. Ooh, and we dinged. Oh, there's a green. Let's do this. Oh, Junkins! Ow. 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 Woo! Let's do this. And I guess it's a good time to start now. Sometimes these guys are a little slow getting around the corner. Pain in the ass, to be honest, but. I guess we gotta work with what we have. <laughs> like how the boomerang came back even though he was dead. <laughs> Fun animation would be like he you toss it and you uh -huh. kill him, you do like a critical strike on him and he dies, but he freezes for a second and then it comes back and like goes through him and shatters him to pieces. I don't know, that sounds kinda cute. Cute. Isn't death such a cute thing? <laughs> Thank you for your cooperation. Hey, we're not dying anymore. I guess we're getting badass. Badass, or maybe I'm less an idiot. That would be kind of cool. Oh, here we go. Looks like these guys are just gonna be all stationary. That's fine. Oh crap. I like to be locked up like that, son. 
Yeah, definitely a lot less greens and blues, that's for sure. The other place was stupidly amount. I'm assuming it was harder than the normal dungeon, and that's why there was a higher drop rate. That's the only thing I can think of. Oh, here's the boss. Oh, is it casting? Maybe this one will drop a, a cloth, like something for me. That would be amazing. Nope, never mind. It's a rogue of some sort. Here, I thought it was casting before, but it's definitely a rogue of some sort. Like ninja moves. My health is staying up pretty good too, which is awesome. I don't like when you do that, so I'm just gonna knock you down. I'm expecting trouble at that point, and I gotta remember to keep using this. Might as well keep using these. Got the mana at the time, so. Oh, we're gonna do that, huh? Little cheating piece of crap. Sit your ass down. Look at my uh, hits. We're at almost 300. Oh, darn it. I reset it, I guess. I wanted to see what it got to. Oh, look at. Yeah! Only a green, guys. A green. So that, I think, confirms that uh, the, the other place, maybe we couldn't see the plus whatever, but it was considered a better dungeon than this, because we definitely got crap all in this dungeon. That is for sure. And to save some time, um, one of the ways I found time saving in a, in a dungeon anyways is you can go do this, or try to do this. <laughs> with our health, it's it's easier if you get stuck in a corner, actually, than a... Come on, hurt me! Ah! Hurt me! I want to die! I want to die! There we go. And there's the pet, finally. I guess I could have put away the cage and re-brought him back out, but meh. Um... There you go. So there's a castle up over here. I say we just keep following the uh, the boss things, the missions, the quests. Might as well, right? It's a beautiful day. The humidity is at a 46%. The temperature is 14 degrees. Oh, God. I would love to live here. 14 degrees is paradise to me. I mean, I'm Canadian, guys, and this is this may come surprise. I mean, you guys in America will have to look this up in Fahrenheit or whatever. But uh, in Celsius, we here get up to 35. Uh, and then the feel like it can get up to 45 to 50. Not always 50, but a lot of times 45, 40 to 45 on the feel like. Like, I guess a lot of people go by that temperature anyways. What it actually feels like outside as a human being with the humidity and the sun and the heat and all that and I guess uh, it's a ridiculous amount but uh, yeah I thought you know it's that's you know and then I hear uh, people are dying in the UK and stuff recently and it's like whoa what like apparently and this I mean you know this is a couple of weeks ago now I guess but uh, there was a thing on uh, something like 800 people have died the heat. I mean, of course, this is not like just random, you know, Bobby Joe down the street died from heat. I mean, this is probably a lot of people who you know, are poor, who live on the street. Look at that. That thing even destroys me with the friggin' damn you are evil whore. But yeah, this is like, you know, you, well, I'm not saying they're all bums, but this a lot of these people are not, you know, your rich kind of people. I'd assume these ones are, you know, elderly, the sick, the poor. Uh, but still, 800 people related to the heat. Isn't that insane and sick? We'd be probably almost there if we had the glider. In a way. Oh, did we level? I didn't even really realize that. We're a level 18. Sweet 18, baby. 
Oh, crap. Don't put it in there. We're starting to dump it all into the glider. There we go. So we had 177, 200, 219. So you can see already it's starting to slow down more and more and more on how much you get. But, hey, it still helps. Eventually it gets to the point where it's like, eh, it's still good and worth putting stuff in it. But you might as well put it into other skill trees for now since you're only getting a slight one. This guy is orange. Let's do it. This is going to be my first... Oh my god. Felt like I was about to die. You know, you were my first, I was going to say, that I killed, but... Oh, I dodged it! Yo, I dodged it! Holy crap! Oh, crap. Take him out before he does something crazy. Yes! <laughs> oh. Honestly, he's not worth killing, is he? But that one I could kill, so... He showed orange. So those guys that are red, I mean, when they're red, they could be any kind of red. I mean, for example, maybe they're power level 100 red. And that's, I guess, a huge, you know, difference on that part. But uh, anyways, that felt good killing one of those. Onionlings! Sorry, but we found a castle today, Onionlings. We're going to be going investigating that. Not sure if we'll be doing it all in this episode, but uh, we'll definitely be doing a bit of a pounding before we uh, end this episode, that's for sure. So now we do the fun of looking in the entrance. So I doubt it's in the lake. So, uh, or in the river, or whatever you want to call this. This is beautiful. It'd be cool if it was like half flooded. But a castle, I think, stays on the same level. doesn't go really downwards. So I guess I could do that exploit through those windows. Remember the teleport one? But I won't do that. Um, and i got to remember, I have that friggin' teleport to get around faster. Actually, maybe this is in the water. I was going to say, it wouldn't be logical to have it in the water, but... Oh, crap. I don't want to deal with those guys. Let's see if we can get up here. Oh, well, that wasn't quite what I meant up, but whatever. Ow! Here we go. Well, I guess we'll defeat our first bull. Darn it. Screwed up my speed thing now. Yes, you knocked over. I love when I knock you over. There we go. Woo. Okay. Ooh, plus ones, but they're white. So maybe I was wrong about the plus ones from before. It'd be neat to see what these guys do. Oh, good. They do die fast, at least. We got something good there. Well, the other one didn't say plus one, so it's interesting why they had a better drop. Wow, these ones are already dropping stuff. Nice. I hope the inventory is unlimited. It keeps expanding so far, so... I haven't had to drop anything off. I mean, I don't mind if I had to. Ooh, look at a different kind of candle. This is the first time I've seen this kind of a red one. Oops, let's get our light on here. Here we go. Oh crap! Well, it's a white one, but still, I didn't expect to fight one of these in a dungeon. I think the best thing is just to take him out. Don't even try to play around with him. Again, shall we? Crap. That guy looked like he was about to go Yeah! Eat dirt! Oh crap. Oh, 
I think you guys can see how the dodge is quite superior at this point. It's been helping quite a bit. Yeah, see, I'm getting low-level items here. So I'm assuming these guys are really white, like very white. For a couple of levels at least. Because they should be harder than the whites I fought. But don't forget, whites are supposed to be kind of under level, sort of. So, I mean, they could be under level for a long time or under, you know, level for a short time. And that's where you don't really know. It'd be kind of cool if there was a way to display their power level, but... Let's see here. Let's just knock all these guys down here. <laughs> yeah, you can see a lot more greens are dropping. Ow! So I wonder what happened at the other dungeon. I really want to know why they had a lot more items dropping. Is this the boss? Yeah, it is, I think. You're a very interesting looking boss. What are you? Oh no. You're like a warrior boss or something. Or no, a mage? What the frick? A little bit of beat, both? I can't be sure, but I think the blue may... Ooh, I don't want to get in this whirlwind, that's for sure. Ooh, my view is screwed up there. And honestly, you probably shouldn't knock him down when he's doing his whirlwind. Because his whirlwind is a free attack for me, because he doesn't seem to move towards me, so... I think you want to get out of the puddles there. It looks like it may do extra damage to you if you stand in them. There you go, he's already gone. Nothing too special. But there you go, that was fun, and that was quick. I can't believe how quick we just did that. Whee! How much EXP? 46, not too bad. Yeah, the higher I get, it's definitely getting more worth, you know, killing the mobs. Or bosses, even though if they don't offer too much. Now, you gotta remember, I haven't moved zones yet. I mean, things are pretty easy here. And I'm actually enjoying it, that style, but uh, we definitely need to move on, and things will get harder, of course, so remember that. Is this the exit? Actually, I said I don't mind uh, doing the thing on an exit, but I won't do the teleport thing going into it. Is that or just killing myself? I don't see a big deal out of that. Um, okay. And it looks like you got a couple more. It keeps going in like a grid pattern. That's awesome. And then right to the border. I'm going to keep following that. So, oh, we can walk a couple minutes just to talk and... Uh, then I think we will continue this lovely episode next time. So, oop, there's that bull guy again. Aha, I forgot about my teleport. Or was that hacks? But I'm having actually quite a lot of fun. This is an awesome grind type game and I enjoy it like this. I could do this all day long. Um, and hopefully I have something to keep talking about. My hype is going, so... <laughs> Sometimes I feel like I'm not exciting enough to, you know, keep it more appealing or fun, but I try. Oh, look at this. Kind of a cave or in a river. That's kind of cool. And you gotta remember my climb's up higher, too. Oh, yeah. Or at least, like, I can do it 50% longer, I guess, or whatever from the points I put in much as I want to kill you, you're not really worth my time. Oh God, you one-shotted. Oh yeah, I'm already done the cotton stuff for now. But, uh, yeah, anyways, guys, I guess uh, next episode I'll meet you at the, uh, the new place. Uh, I'll head there. I don't know what it's called, don't know what it is, but we'll definitely head there. And uh, I'll see you then, I guess. And uh, thank you so much for watching. And see you guys and girls. Hopefully there's girls out there. I say that once in a while. Uh, it's good to see girls on the internet and playing video games. Uh, I'll see you guys later.